Hey there folks, how we doing? Um, this should be, I hope, another short one. 7.51 a.m. Saturday, October 15th, 2016. Um, E does not equal MC squared, um, question mark, question mark. What's that about? Damn, this old man in overalls really thinks he knows everything about everything, huh? Um, all of you have access to incredible intelligence um, when you're your normal self. The intelligence is there, plus you have your own. The knowledge is there, plus you have your own intelligence. Um, but when, you're, when we're stuck in a body, we're screwed. Okay? Now, I'm not saying I can access all this stuff and bring it out as I want. It doesn't work like that. Not for me, and I don't want it to. I got too much I'm doing. Human brain can only handle so much. Um... All of you, when you're out of your body, in your normal state, uh, spirit, free form, uh, en um, sentient energy, you have incredible intelligence. Um, Einstein uh, was an incredible man. He was a strong soul, um, had a lot of light blue energy. He could inspire hope. He was a strong thinker. He had some very serious deep blue in there, too, strength of affirmations, and some red heart, love, energy. Um, Everybody can point out someone's uh, faults uh, as far as a character or something, and it's faults according to them. Whatever. Everyone's in a body being abused. You know, it's, dwelling on that is like dwelling on the negative. It's, no thanks. I dwell on the processes in front of me to keep going forward with what I got to do, but I'm driven more than most people. Um, I, I'm, I was made for a reason, and I have to move forward with that. You know, just whatever. Um, anyway, um, the uh, one thing Einstein did say <coughs> that I want to comment on, and only one thing. Um, energy can neither be created nor destroyed. Um, I'm going to give you the information on that. Um, it can be created, and it is daily. And although it doesn't happen much, it can be destroyed. Now, in order to understand some of this... Hey, Herky, I'm trying to hurry, buddy. Um, I've told you all how you grow. as energy, when you go in, a, in the body, you have a life. And then when you come out, your energy actually grows. Your spirit, which is sentient energy, when you, come, when you have a life, you're in the body. When the body dies, you come out and you grow. And when you come out, when you've had a life that's really abusive, when you come out, you grow more. Okay, this is strengthening and building frequencies. It's building up your own energy, but it is increasing the size of your energy. Okay? Um, so, energy cannot be created. Well, if you're growing it, that's creating it in one form or another. Okay, I'm not trying to tear apart his stuff. Einstein is so cool. The spirit inside him, awesome. Awesome soul. Um, remember, as, as intelligent as he is, he didn't design any starships that are flying around everywhere. Folks, there's all kinds of stuff for us to learn. Um, if he would have been in a body where he could have been alive for a thousand years and had access to more of a database and everything else to work with, and equipment? Man, imagine what he could have done, huh? He's had a lot of very important lives on a lot of planets. Um, but energy does is grown. Okay? Um, it's unfortunate, I know this firsthand, but energy can be destroyed. Um... 
pretty much only a few people are ever going to understand that while they're in the body. Uh, Paul, Berju, Deanna, they understand it. They've seen what's happened. I was talking with Berju yesterday. I mean, this has happened, I don't know how many times. It's, it's sad. Anyway, uh, and she, when I get rid of something, she can see it. And then there's ways to bring it back, and then there's ways to where it's permanently deleted. It can't be brought back. If you can think of the first dimension, folks, where energy moves like in and out of itself. Um, and that's a strange place. Um, for a sane mind to look at that would pretty much drive you nuts in less than 60 seconds. I don't mean permanently insane, but I mean staring at that for about 20 seconds would be enough to either make you puke or something, but you definitely, it's like, that's enough. The conscious mind can't understand it. Good herky, honey. I love you, buddy. So anyway, uh, I'll hurry up, I know. I just want to say that uh, um, as you've grown through your lives, your energy gets bigger. That's a form of creating energy. Okay? Um, you create the amount of frequencies uh, you create those frequencies that give off different auric expressions auras you increase the number of them okay you grow so when you increase frequencies you're increasing frequencies of energy you're increasing your energy okay in that one way energy does you know can be created um in all the other ways everything we look at it um i don't know about you but i'm back in einstein I'm going with him. Um, but metaphysically, your energy, folks, you're all huge compared to what you were when you started in the first stage of evolution of the soul. You were literally this orb that just came, or spirit, you all just came out, you were this one beautiful orb of energy. Then you split into male and female, you start having lives, after enough, li after enough lives, you come out of body at one point, and then you, your energy just phew, opens up like this. The body energy is solar plexus, and then you have three focal points within it of brain, of heart, and of emotion. Okay, so it's data processing, uh, heart, which is feelings, and then emotion. And then it's all inside a big energy field, which is solar plexus. I love you, Herky. Good man, honey. So, uh, good boy, honey. I'm going as fast as I can. Um, and you do produce, you grow new frequencies. Like we grow new cells. It doesn't grow like that that quick, okay? But I mean, just the basic process of your, um, you know, your body does grow a little bit up to a certain age, folks. When you're your true self and you're in your natural form, spirit, sentient energy, when you go into life and have a body and you're, com you're compressed in there and then you're beat up, abused, you come out, you do grow a little bit. You don't have to be abused to grow, but... The original first being male and female. They didn't care about what you thought and how you felt. They just want to grow you bigger. Um, anyway, it's like using steroids. But anyway, um, um, and, you know, this, I can't really explain it, and I don't like talking about it, but it, it, um, energy can be destroyed. Just made to disappear. Folks, stuff like that. Understanding the destruction part of it, um, if it wasn't for the fact that it, it's true and it exists, I never would have brought it up. Um, but as far as the growth of it, which is uh, energy can be created because you expand your own, but you're not just making it bigger, you're growing more. You actually grow more energy. So. Um, that's why there's all these question marks, you know, in, uh, um, on the title of this thing. Uh, I'm no scientist, but I can tell you what I know from energy. You do grow. Folks, it's all kinds of, uh, you, you do individually, all of you, grow, have been grown in size. You're huge compared to what you started as. Every time you have a life, you grow. You grow your own energy. You grow your own self. 
you increase the number of frequencies within your energetic field within you your true self spirit that is a form of creating energy anyway um, there's all kinds of new things we're going to learn um, a lot of people don't uh, appreciate uh, Albert Einstein like I do um, the spirit that was inside him but the work that he did too uh, he was an, an incredible man worthy of uh, your respect and compassion as long as you have that in you um, but I'm just saying that you know and no one knows everything wait till you find the new laws of physics we're going to develop when our friends come in with their starships people will say crystal people say stones crystals don't have energy <laughs> yeah wait till you see the way some extremely old intelligent races have found ways to manipulate that energy and run starships okay faster than the speed of light anyway folks look I love you um I'm not beating up on Albert I love him um but I just need to get that out there you continually grow and through having lives and going through stress your own energy within you grows okay you grow new new frequencies additional strands of frequencies within you it's hard to describe um, so um, well no it's not like that either it's almost like DNA growing new strands or something that you know you develop but you do grow more free individual frequencies of energy which is that's the best way I can explain it I just had to say that folks love you man have a good one.